Well, this is the kind of match every football fan looks forward to. A lot on the line and the likelihood of a tension-packed occasion. Stay tuned, we'll have all the action for you live here on EA TV. And welcome to a game that really should have pulses racing. Every reason to believe this will be enthralling. I'm Derek Ray, perched here on the commentary gantry, and sitting alongside me to provide expert analysis is Stuart Robson. And we have action from Liga Uber Eats coming right up for you. It is not, and they take on Angers. Well, Derek, when looking forward to this game, you can't help but notice there are some great matchups all over the pitch, particularly in those central areas. Whichever team wins more of those battles will win the game. The starting lineup then for Nantes. Well, it's a defensive lineup, that's for sure. But their wing backs and at least one of their midfield players will need to break forward when they regain possession, just to give them a threat going forward. And a look at the starting lineup for Angers. Well, as you can see, they're playing with a front two, three central midfield players and a couple of wing backs. It's a great system when played well, but it does leave them vulnerable to switches of play. And so the battle commences. Oh, great vision. He cuts it back. He just missed that little bit of attacking spark. Goalkeeper's ball. They know they need to stop him. Not to be in terms of the cross there. Goal kick coming up. Fulgini. Well, he's given us away. And the ball's gone. That is tackling of the highest order. Well, play stopped. It is a free kick. He goes short. Well, he stopped them in their tracks. Can they take advantage? Well, I must say, it did look so promising, but the flag is raised. Offside the verdict, Stuart. Well, he's just too eager there. It's the right run, but he's made it too early. show still on level terms moving the ball nicely sends it back and how well the keeper did well that's just exceptional he reacted so quickly there
Well, the short corner routine. Defensive excellence there. Blas and slipped through beautifully. A terrific pass. Is it going to be? And denied by the post. And the danger is averted. Well, they can all calm down now, Derek. They've got away with that one, you have to say. Well, that was a bit unlucky because you just get the feeling they need to make the most of one of these chances. The attack continues, they're making considerable progress and it should have been the first goal of the game. Well, I can't believe that chance has been squandered. That should have been the opener. Sebastian Korcha. Pedro Tirivea. Well, he's given us away. Well, the visitors very much dictating the tempo over the last 15 minutes or so and looked a real threat going forward. But they must take one of these chances while they're having this good period that you do sense it's coming. Well, still an issue here. Lovely first touch. That wasn't easy. This might be the perfect counter-attacking opportunity. And a goal! He's put it away! A celebratory moment! Well, let's see this again. This is counter-attacking football at its very best. But when he shoots, I expected him to go across the goalkeeper. He should never beat the goalkeeper inside that near post. That's not good keeping. Started 1-0 here. Fujini. Delightful pass. Offside it is. Such a pity for him. Well, he thought he was onside, but I think the assistant got that absolutely right. Girotto, Chirivea. This looks more than decent. Excellent use of the ball as they make their way forward. And it might be. Oh, incredible save. And he snuffed out the danger. So, getting close to the half-time interval, and it's going with home advantage, albeit not by a lot. Stuart, what have you made of what you've seen so far? Yes, they've defended really well all over the pitch. Their work rate and discipline has been excellent. But any drop in tempo, and this lead could easily slip away. And the referee has awarded a corner following that touch. the delivery and they deal with the threat this time a chance then for the respective managers to address their charges it is half time here well he's been the standout for his side so far don't you think Stuart well it was certainly a good first 45 minutes for the lad obviously he got his goal to put them in front but he's looked lively throughout too hopefully we see more of him in the second half
plenty to consider based on what we've seen so far as the second half begins. Well, they couldn't keep possession. Cho. And they continue to advance. And a lot of options here. And gobbled up with ease by the keeper. Jimmy Cabell. Could be threatening. Well, Buffal! Oh, a moment of pure class! Had to catch it perfectly, and didn't he just? Well, here's the replay. What a superb volley this is. He strikes it so cleanly, and he times it perfectly. So back underway following the equaliser. Getting the better of his opponent. And his teammate got him out of trouble. Cho. Well, we have 30 minutes to go. Giving the ball away. Just lost his focus. Throw in here. Well, no escape, not an immediate yellow card, but the referee deals with him now. So a personnel change then. Options in the middle. Superbly read and executed. Jimmy Cabell couldn't hang on to the ball Castelletto keeping the ball moving must score ball is loose well threat over for now Longani, Suleiman Dumbia. Definitely look as though they want to make this move count. Still on level terms, moving the ball nicely. But then the one that fails to hit its target. Bodies forward and the break looks on. Show. On the offensive, is there to be late excitement? And he takes it on, and fine goalkeeping. Well, you just never know about chances near the end. You've got to be opportunistic. Will this corner do it? Substitution then. Let's see how it affects the match. And the short option preferred. Turning inside, where's he going to go? It's still there for him. Well, a really important piece of goalkeeping at this stage. Well, it's such a key moment in the game. That's a really good save. Changement pour 
Well, they've been getting the substitute ready, and now they will make the personnel change. Suleiman Dumbia, remplacé par le numéro 27, Mathias Pereira So the corner played into the box. Well, not quite the ideal delivery. Can they nudge in front late on here? Straightforward piece of goalkeeping. Good use of advantage by the referee. Can they slot it home? A goal! Late on! And one that silences the majority! Well, let's take another look at this. And from the attacking point of view, everything's right. The shot across the goalkeeper, players coming in for the rebound, and there's not much the goalkeeper could do about that. He made a good effort on the first one, couldn't react to the second. So the ball is rolling again. 2-1 the score. What's going to happen next? Palois. Ludovic Blas. Well, on the attack, hunting for a late equaliser here. Cross blocked. And there goes the final whistle. It's gone the wrong way as far as the home fans are concerned. Yes, Derek, there was very little in it for much of the game. I'm sure they feel they deserve a point at least. And it's obviously disappointing to concede in that manner so late on. But they just have to bounce back now. Well, this man has given us plenty of reasons to dwell on his performance, hasn't he, Stuart? Well, of course, his finishing could have been better today. But he scored one and made a lot of chances for himself. I thought he was outstanding.